How's it going everybody? Now for this video, I am reviewing The Devil's Rejects, the sequel to House of a Thousand Corpses. Now, and I heard that Three from Hell is a sequel to um, The Devil's Rejects also. So it's like three movies. They have three movies of these. And I have to say, the first one I thought was, you know, pretty good, but not the best. And then, you know, The Devil's Rejects I thought was better. And I'm going to explain to you why now. Yes, some of the kills are great. The kills are great. The story was better than, than the first one. And um and this freaking sheriff is nothing to fuck with. Like this this sheriff this sheriff he don't play games. He don't fucking play games. But I hate how they killed him off towards the end of the film. It's like, are we supposed to care about these fucking um, killers now? Like, what the fuck? He said, fuck all that shit. I'm killing every last one of y'all motherfuckers. So, like, he's just like, fuck it. I'm killing y'all all. Like, y'all motherfuckers. Like, and then, you know, you're a little bit of his backstory. Um, because, you know, supposedly they killed his brother. But it's like, um, but it's like, yeah, it's, they, he showed him the pictures of all these people that end up dying. But this motherfucker... This sheriff does not play any fucking games. He don't waste any fucking time. He says, where are these fucking motherfuckers at? Like, he says, y'all made these motherfuckers suffer. I'm making y'all motherfuckers suffer. This motherfucker's crazy. I, this cop is badass. This cop was badass up until the fucking end of the fucking movie when he fucking died. Like, like he freaking... So that one girl, he said... He said, I'm going to show you how it feels like to feel fucking hopeless. How does it feel, motherfucker? Just started whooping ass with the fucking belt and shit. It was fucking crazy. You beat the shit out of it. This movie, I liked it way better than I did the first one, obviously. Um, and normally movies don't top the first one, but this movie just makes me want to watch Three from Hell. Because um, it's a sequel to these movies. And, like... Three from Hell is probably a damn good movie. Because The Devil's Rejects is a damn good ass movie. You got some good kills. You got a good, decent story. You got a good story. The story was better than the first one was. And um, The Devil's Rejects is freaking crazy. It's freaking crazy. And I enjoy it. I enjoy it. If I had to rate this film, 9.5 out of 10. That's a damn good score. A 9.5 out of 10. I enjoyed this fucking movie from start to finish. I loved it. I loved it. And um, I would watch it again. I highly recommend it. If you haven't seen The Devil's Rejects, highly recommend it. But first watch the first one. Then watch the second one. Because you might be confused if you haven't seen the um, first one. And just jump right into this one. You might be confused. But I enjoy both of these films. But, you know, the first one I thought was decent. You know, it wasn't anything special. But this one, The Devil's Rejects, I enjoy it. I enjoy the film. I enjoy it. I do recommend it. I recommend this film. It's good to watch around October also. It's just, The Devil's Rejects, it's good. If you if if you like Rob Zombie, you like The Devil's Rejects. Now, um... I feel like when Rob Zombie did the remake of Halloween, he put some of this score in with the um, Halloween score at the same time. So, it's crazy because, like, you got a little bit of Rob Zombie's flavor from the remake of Halloween in this film. But, yeah, I enjoy this film. It's a 9.5 out of 10. I do recommend it. Those y'all that haven't seen it, it's... It's a damn crazy ass, balls up the wall ass crazy movie. I love it. I love it. 9.5 out of 10 for me. For The Devil's Rejects. So yeah, um, I guess that's it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Please subscribe and share. And also hit the bell so you know when new videos are uploaded. Peace out. Hope you enjoyed this video. And I'm out. Peace.